It's October 1st, also known to some as the real beginning of fall. Time to get those pumpkins right. out, decorate, <laughs> and the cooler temps and changing leaves signify the beginning of busy season, also for the agritourism industry. Today, reporter Blake Stevens went to Oaks Farm to find out how they're preparing now for thousands of visitors. We call it fall, but Ken Oaks calls it crazy season. It starts off kind of slow, and then October's crazy, and then it's over. Uh, but uh, it's, it's a lot of fun. We look forward to it. You know, a lot of work throughout the year getting ready for this. This is their 21st year preparing the corn maze, the pumpkin patch, and gearing up for all the hay rides. We didn't know what we were doing when we were getting into this. You know, I talked to my neighbor across the street, and he's farmed his whole life. He's like, you know, people are going to pay you to walk through a cornfield. I was like, well, that's the idea. It turned out to be a great idea, given thousands of people come here every October. Last year was an unusual year. You know, nothing else was open. You know, no fairs, you know, sporting events were, were cut back and whatnot. Uh, so last year was uh, a lot of folks looking to do stuff, so we were busy last year. But we also had to uh, limit attendance last year. Uh, you know, because of COVID, we did time ticketing and uh, limited the crowds. So this year, we're, we're not having to do that. So uh, we're hoping for a good year. The cooler temperatures and changing leaves are a catalyst, but Oaks thinks there's another reason some make this an annual tradition. I grew up on a farm, so I'm kind of used to walking on fields and walking through the fields and cornfields and you name it. Uh, but for a lot of folks, you know, that's not part of their, you know, what they grew up with. So just the ability to get out in a big open area, you know, walk through a cornfield, you know, pick pumpkins from a patch, um, that's something that they don't always get to do. In Corrington, Blake Stevens, WATE 6 on your side. Now, we have attached a link to Oaks Farm's hours of operation on our website, WATE.com. There, you'll also find new activities that were added there this year. Just be sure to search for this story.